Taking a bus. Dialogue 1. Does this bus get to Washington Square? Oh, no. You should take the number 52 tram car. Thank you. Where can I take it? Two blocks down the street. What's the stop called? International Fair Center. But I don't know which stop I should get off. You can get off in three more stops. Three more stops? The sign will say Washington Square. Get off there. Dialogue 2 Welcome to our bus. Excuse me, is this the right bus for Ling Yin Temple? Yes, it's number 7 bus. Do I have to change? No, Ling Yin Temple is the terminal of this bus. How much is the ticket? It's 2 yuan. Please drop your money into the box and be seated in the rear. When we get there, I'll let you know. Thank you. You're welcome. Taking the subway. Dialogue 1. Can I help you? What should I do with the token? You put it in the slot at the turnstile and then push the turnstile to get into the platform. By the way, how can I get out of the platform after I get off the train? That's very easy. The exits are always open, and there are signs, you'll see. Dialogue 2 Which train do I take to the fifth circle? Take the uptown C train and get off at the sixth station. How about the transfer? You can ask the officer when you buy ticket. And where can I get the train? Just go down those steps. Thank you very much. Taking a taxi. Dialogue 1. Hi, taxi. Please hop in. Where to? Guanghua Hotel, please. Okay, put this baggage into the trunk, please. Do you think you can get me there within half an hour? I think we can get there in time if there are no holdups. Are you in a hurry? Yes, I have an appointment at 3.30 p.m. You will be there in plenty of time. Don't worry. Dialogue 2 Let me off in front of Park Hotel. Okay, here we are. What's the fare? $25. Here is the money. Keep the change, please. Oh, thanks a lot. Taking a train. Dialogue 1. Second class return to London, please. That's 25 pounds, please. Here you are. When does the train for London depart? You'd better hurry. It leaves in five minutes. I don't think I can make it. When is the next train for London? At 10.30. Thank you. I'll take that one. Dialogue 2 Is this car 5? Yes, get in, please. Where is my berth, please? It's over there. Let me show you. Where shall we put our suitcases? On the overhead rack. Oh, it's full. Put them under the berth. Missing the train or bus. Dialogue 1 which is the train to Yellowstone Park? Sorry, I'm afraid the train to Yellowstone Park just left. Oh my god, I missed the train! No problem. The train to Yellowstone Park leaves per hour. You can take the next one. Good. Will I take it in the same platform? No, the next train will stop at the third platform. Do I need buy another ticket? No, you don't. Thank you. Dialogue 2 Can you do me a favor? I was with the Gray Line tour, and I've missed the bus. What should I do? Which tour were you on? Tour 1, the full-day sightseeing tour. I see. Well, I'm sure that bus stops at the Century Plaza, so you can catch it there. Great, I'll take a taxi. I'd catch a local bus if I were you. It leaves from the bus stop on the corner by the bank. 
What's the number? Number three. The Century Plaza stop is either the sixth or the seventh. Ask the driver. Okay, thank you very much. Hope you catch it. Getting off. Dialogue one. Excuse me. What is the next station? Chinatown. Is this where I get off? Where are you going? Fu Chao Restaurant. Right here. It's just near the stop. Okay. Thank you. Dialogue two. What did you say your stop was? The Fifth Avenue. The Fifth Avenue. You are past your stop. You should have gotten off at the last stop. Should I? But you didn't call me. Sorry, there are too many people. I forgot it. Is it far from here? Don't worry. You can get off at the next stop and walk back. It's just a couple of blocks. What is the next stop? It's City Square. Renting a car. Dialogue one. I want to rent a car for one week. Okay, no problem. What type do you have in mind? Do you have any Japanese cars? Midsize SUV. Yes. Let me see. We have a Honda Odyssey. Is that okay? Great. What's the rate per day? It's fifty dollars plus tax per day, unlimited mileage. I'm going to keep it for five days. Can I see your driver's license? Sure. Here is my driver's license. Please sign here. Dialogue two. How many people will be driving the car? Only me. Do you offer insurance on this rental car? Yes, we do. Do you want insurance? I'd like full insurance. Good. The insurance for one person is two dollars a day. All right. Can I return the car at another one of your agencies? Yes. Just make sure to show them your driver's license, and they will be able to pull all your information from the computer. Okay. Here is our emergency roadside service phone number. If you have any problems. Just call, and someone will come pick you up. Parking. Dialogue one. Hi. Any spot left? Yes, there are still plenty of spots. What is the parking fee per hour here? Ten yuan an hour. How much would it be if I parked here for an hour and ten minutes? Twenty yuan, sir. We charge by the number of hours. I see. Thanks. Dialogue two. Excuse me, sir. Is this your car? Yeah. What's wrong? I'm afraid you've parked in the wrong spot. Oh, really? Isn't this spot E one two three? No, it's F one two three. My parking space. Yours is over there. I'm sorry. I must have been confused. I'll move my car right away. It's no big deal. Being fined for violation. Dialogue one. Excuse me, miss. May I see your driver's license? Yes, here it is. Any violations, officer? You were speeding. I'm sorry. I don't know the speed limit of this zone. This is a thirty-five mile zone. And you were driving forty-five. There is your citation. Please read the instructions on it and go to pay the fine. Okay. May I have my driver's license now? Here you go. Be careful from now on. I'll keep it in mind. Thank you. Dialogue two. Hey boy, get off, please. You were just running a red light. Was I? I didn't see the red light. Did you? Look, it's just behind you. Now, please show me your license. Here is my license. I have to give you a penalty ticket. How much will I be fined for running a red light? The citation is three hundred ninety-two USD, plus traffic school fee, 
40 USD. That will be 432 USD. Oh dear, you know I'm a visitor here, so I'm quite strange to this place. Well, in that case, I will let you go. Please pay attention to the traffic regulations here. Thank you very much. I will be careful next time. Traffic Accidents Dialogue 1 Oh my God! Are you all right, miss? Thank goodness. I'm just all right. I'm very sorry I hit you. And I hope that the damage to your car isn't serious. The left front side is dented. We should call the police. Don't worry. I will call the cop at once. All right. May I have your plate number? Sure. I'll write it down on my business card, and my insurance will pay for this. They will contact you soon. Thanks. Anyway, I feel really sorry for this. Dialogue 2 Hello, 911. Can I help you? It's an emergency. I was in a car accident. Where did it happen? What street are you on? East Hilton Drive. Stay right there. We'll be there in five minutes. Could you call an ambulance for me? My friend was hurt. Okay. To the hotel. Dialogue 1. Could you have a taxi pick me up and take me to your hotel before 1 o'clock p.m.? What is your place, sir? Palace Airport. Which terminal will you be at? Number 2. Okay. Someone will be there by 12.15. What are your rates? It is $2 initially and 35 cents for each quarter mile. I have four very large suitcases. Will those fit in the taxi? No, I'll send a larger vehicle to pick you up. Dialogue 2 Hello, Hilton Hotel. My name is Ed Chin. I would like to request a pickup from the airport. Certainly, sir. Please exit the terminal and go to the pickup spot just outside the door. I will radio a driver to meet you. How long will it take? About 10 minutes. How long is the ride to the hotel? Traffic is backed up today, so it will take about 30 minutes. Sorry about that. No problem. Thank you. Checking in with reservation. Dialogue 1 I'd like to check in. May I have your name? Yes, Li Ming. Do you have a reservation with us, sir? Yes, I do. Mr. Li Ming, your reservation is for a double room for two nights, right? That's right. Could you fill out the registration card, please? All right. How would you like to settle your bill? By credit card. Okay, your room number is 25 on the third floor. Have an enjoyable stay. Dialogue 2 My name is James Brooks. I have a reservation. I'm sorry, Mr. Brooks. You had planned to arrive at about 6 tonight, but it is near midnight now, so we cancelled your reservation. Yes, I didn't have a chance to call you. Do you have any other rooms available? We only have an executive suite available now. How much are those? $550 a night. That's pretty expensive. But I guess I've no choice. But I want to change rooms tomorrow. Leading to the room. Dialogue 1. Here we are. This is your room. The bathroom is here. Are there any extra blankets? Sometimes I feel cold at night. You can call the chambermaid and ask her for that. Okay. And can I have some ice? There's a machine near the elevator. Just help yourself. If you need anything else, please call room service. Thank you. This is for you. Thank you, sir. Enjoy your visit.
Dialogue 2 Well, what do you think of the room? It's very pleasant and it's also cool. I love the color scheme. White and blue are cool colors, and of course, the room is air-conditioned. There is plenty of hanging space in these fitted wardrobes. In fact, more than I shall need. Perhaps you'll need it when you buy the lovely clothes. By the way, you have a telephone on the bedside table. That's very convenient, as you can phone whenever you want. I'm going to enjoy it. The bathroom is over there. And we have a 24-hour hot and cold water supply. Laundry service. Dialogue 1. Hello, Mama. Good afternoon. What can I do for you? Can I have the laundry done today? Certainly, sir. Can you fill out the laundry form first, please? Okay. Here you are. That's fine. Thank you. By the way, where is your laundry? Here, in the laundry bag. Any more? No. Do I then leave it outside my room? No, leave it inside and someone will pick it up. When will it be ready? Tomorrow morning. Dialogue 2 I'd like to have this laundry done. Could you fill out the laundry form? Okay. I want to have this sweater washed by hand in cold water. It might shrink otherwise. By hand in cold water. I understand. And I'd like this garment dry cleaned, please. Okay, anything else? Do you have a mending service for clothes? I'd like the dress mended. Yes, we can mend them. When will they be ready? We will deliver them tomorrow evening around 6 o'clock p.m. Room service. Dialogue 1. What time do you begin your service in the morning? We usually start from 7. But if you have special needs, you can tell the front desk the night before. Oh, but... Or you can also tell me now. We'll send your food over at your requested time. Very good. Could you send two American breakfasts to our room at 6.30 tomorrow morning? We must leave the hotel before 7 o'clock. No problem. So, room 1005, two American breakfasts, 6.30 tomorrow morning. That's right. Dialogue 2. Room service, may I help you? Can I still get something to eat at this time of night? What would you like? I'll have a sandwich and a hot chocolate. What kind of sandwich would you like? We have steak, cheese, ham, salami, tuna, chicken. I'll take the tuna, please. No problem, sir. May I have your name and your room number? This is Bob Jackson, room 801. Good. I'll be up in a couple of minutes. Morning call service. Dialogue 1. Will you do me a favor, miss? Certainly, sir. I wonder if your hotel has the morning call service. Yes, sir. Would you like a morning call? Yes. I must get up earlier tomorrow. At what time do you want me to call you up, sir? At 6 sharp tomorrow morning, please. By phone or by knocking at the door? By phone. Okay. I'll tell the operator to call you up at 6 o'clock tomorrow morning. Anything else I can do for you? No, thanks. Dialogue 2 Room service, can I help you? I'm going to New York early tomorrow morning, so I would like to request an early morning call. No problem. At what time would you like us to call you tomorrow morning? At 6 sharp tomorrow morning, please. By phone or by knocking at the door? By knocking at the door, I usually have a deep sleep. Okay, so we will wake you up at 6 tomorrow morning. Housekeeping Dialogue 1 Housekeeping, may I clean your room now, madam? 
Come in, please. Good morning, madam. Good morning. What about tidying up a bit in the bathroom? We've had a bath and it's quite a mess. Okay, I clean the toilet bowl, wash basin, and tub. Then put some fresh towels there. And we need two more pairs of bath slippers. All right. I get off at 10 30 a.m. But I will tell the daytime attendant to send them up. Thank you. And the children have just played on the bed, so please change our sheets and pillowcases. No problem. I will tidy it up. You've been so helpful. Thank you. Dialogue 2 Housekeeping, may I come in? Oh, sorry. I haven't even got up yet. When would you like me to do your room? Could you come back in an hour? I'm sorry to disturb you. If you need clean your room, please call DTS or HSKP or hang the Make Up the Room card. I will, thank you. Maintenance Service Dialogue 1 Is this the maintenance department? This is room 403. Yes, what is it, sir? The TV set in my room doesn't work. Have you checked the plug? They get pulled out sometimes. Yes, I checked that. And this is the second time that it hasn't worked. I'm sorry. I'll send someone right up to have a check. Thank you. Dialogue 2 Room service, may I help you? This is from room 208. I'm afraid that the heating system doesn't work. It's very cold here. Have you switched it on the radiator? Yes, I have switched it on for almost half an hour. The room is still very cold. We're terribly sorry for that. We'll send our staff to fix it now. Or do you want to change your room? I prefer not to move first. Okay. Is it convenient for us to come now? Yes, please. Offline service. Dialogue 1. Hello, Mr. Wang? Yes, what is the matter? Oh, you have a message note here. Who's it from? A Mr. Lee. He said he's your friend in New York, and he wanted you to call him back as soon as possible. Let me see. Oh, it's Tom. Did he say anything else? No, nothing else. All right. Thank you very much. Dialogue 2. This is Johnson in room 218. Yes, Mr. Johnson. Any messages for me? Just a moment, sir. Yes, Mr. Johnson, there's a message for you. Who is it from? It's from John Simmons. S I M M O N S. Will you read it to me, please? He said, I will come to your hotel tomorrow afternoon at 3. What time did Mr. Simmons call? Did he leave his phone number? At 10 30 this morning. His home phone number is 5716-2322. Is there anything else, sir? No, thank you. Goodbye. Barber Service Dialogue 1 Good morning, sir. I'm the top stylist here. Take a seat, please. Thank you. I want a haircut, please. Very well. And how would you like your haircut, sir? Just a trim and cut the sides fairly short, but not so much at the back. Nothing off the top? Well, a little off the top. How about the front? Leave the front as it is. Okay. Do you want me to trim your mustache? Yes, please. Dialogue 2. What would you like? Permanent wave, cold wave, or washed and dressed? A shampoo and set, please. Would you like a new hairstyle, or just keep it the way you have it now? I'm ready for a new hairdo. Do you have any suggestions? Perhaps you should go even shorter. I'll leave it up to you. Like I said, I'm ready for a change. I've had it this way for so long, and I'm getting tired of it. Okay, you should also get highlights put in. 
I'm worried it will make my hair look unnatural. No, no, that would be very subtle. Making complaints. Dialogue 1. Operator. Yes, may I help you? I've been trying to get through to the front desk for the last five minutes. Their line is always busy. Why did it take so long? I'm very sorry to hear that, sir. During peak hours, the line is often engaged. Shall I ask them to call you back when the line is free? Thank you. Dialogue 2 Could I see the manager, please? I have a complaint. Can I help you, madam? Yes, I checked in your hotel on Wednesday. During my staying here, something made me feel uncomfortable. I'm all ears. First, when I checked in, the receptionist complained that I didn't make a reservation. But is it necessary to make a reservation for each time? No, it's not necessary. Second, in the guest room, some facilities had problems. Some lights couldn't turn on. And there is no hot water in the washroom. And TV channels are too limited. I'm sorry to hear that. The last, the service for guest room was too slow. And the staff was in a bad service attitude. I'm terribly sorry to hear that. I'll attend to it immediately. Checking out. Dialogue 1. I would like to pay the bill. I'll be right with you, Mr. House. Have you made any long-distance calls, please? Yes, last night to Rome. How would you like to take care of it? Can I pay my bill with a traveler's check? I'm sorry, sir. We only accept RMB or a credit card. That being the case, I'll pay with American Express. Of course, sir. If you would just check the additional charges and sign, that will be everything. Everything seems to be in order. Here is your receipt. We hope you will stay with us again. Dialogue 2 Good morning. We'd like to check out now, please. May I have your room number, please? Certainly. This is room 501. We'll send someone up to help you with your luggage right away. Could you tell me which is better to go to the airport, by bus or by taxi? I recommend a taxi if you are in a hurry. How long does it take to the airport by taxi? About half an hour. Can you call a taxi for me? Okay, please wait a minute. Other requests. Dialogue 1. Reception, may I help you? I've lost my room key when I went out. Will you open it for me? But do you have another key to your room, the extra key? Oh, sorry, I left in my room. In that case, I can send up the bellboy with a master key. What is your room number? 1205. Where are you? I'm right outside my room. I'll send someone to open the door in a minute. You may wait upstairs now. Dialogue 2 Good evening. Can I help you? Good evening. I'm Li Jing in room 102. I wonder if it is possible for me to extend my stay for two days. I'll take a look at the hotel's booking situation. Yes, I'm glad that we'll be able to accept your extension request. But I'm afraid you have to change rooms for the last two nights. You see, we have already let your room to someone else. Is that okay? Yes, no problem. Let me see. Room 210 will be vacant. How about that room? That is fine. The new occupant will be checking in a little after 12 tomorrow. That means I have to move out before 12. Well, I think I will move at 10.30. Jewelry Dialogue 1 May I help you find something, sir? I'm looking for a ring. Tell me a little bit about what you want. We have all shapes, sizes, qualities, and price ranges. 
Well, my price range is $3,000 to $5,000. I'm looking for a Marquise cut on a wide band. You just have a good taste. Let me show you what we have. I'd like to take a look around some more. Okay, take your time. And if you have any other questions, just call me. Dialogue 2 Can I be of any assistance to you, madam? Please show me this pearl necklace. Yes, here it is. Cultured pearls? Yes. Oh, I like it. They are just beautiful. I'll buy it. Today is just weekend, and all the jewelry is on sale. That's great. How much is this one? One thousand dollars. Is it tax-free? Yes, for tourists. I'll take it. Then I'll wrap it for you. Artworks Dialogue 1 Good afternoon, sir. Could I be of any service? Good afternoon. I'd like to buy a cloisonne vase. Yes, sir. Just over there. I like a medium-sized cloisonne vase with a light blue background. How do you like this one? The background is pale blue with traditional Chinese paintings of mountains and rivers. It's gorgeous. How much is it? 150 yuan. That is too much. Can you come down a little bit? I can give you a 20% discount. I will take it if you can take 50 yuan off the price. All right. You can have it at this price. This price is reasonable. I will take it. Here is the money. Thank you. Dialogue 2 Can I help you? I want to get this reproduction of Mona Lisa. How much is it? The marked price is 700 yuan. That's too much. I'll take it if you give me a 50% discount. Well, I can just take 100 yuan off the price. All right, I will take it. Could you mount it for me? No problem. I will do that for you. You can come to pick it up tomorrow afternoon. Okay. Be sure to pack it well. Electronic Products Dialogue 1 Good morning. Can I help you? I want an iPod, please. What about this one? It's handy and only $60. Do you have a cheaper one? Have a look at this one. It's only $50. How do I switch it on? Press the play button on top and turn up the volume knob. I see. It sounds very good. I'll take it. Dialogue 2 Hello. Could you show me that Canon autofocus camera? Okay, here you are. How much does it cost? $169. It's too much. Can you reduce the price? It depends. How many do you want? I will buy three if you can give me a lower price. Wait a minute. I'll ask our manager. Okay. If you buy three, we can reduce the price to 150 well, I will take three. Leatherware Dialogue 1 I'm looking for a handbag as a gift. We just received a shipment of several different styles handbags. Would you show me the white handbag? Here you are. You're in luck. This is the only one left. White is popular this season. Yes, I believe it is. But there is a stain here. We have something that might interest you. Oh, anything better? Look at this one. What do you like it? Wow, I have never seen such a nice handbag. I'll take this one. Let me ring this up for you at the register. Dialogue 2 Are you being attended to, madam? Well, I'm just looking for something for my husband. What would you recommend? Would you please come over here, madam? I'd like to show you some fancy waistband. They are made of the leather of kangaroos and crocodiles. Oh, they look so elegant. I like the light brown one. May I have a look at it? Sure. It is the latest fashion. 
Its simple style makes it easier to go with different clothes. That's it. I think he will be satisfied to have it. Cosmetics Dialogue 1 What can I do for you, sir? Yes, it's my first visit here. I need to get my fiancé some Chanel. Please look at these. All of these are from Chanel. Wow, too many to choose. I recommend you this. The smell is nice. Is it a typical Paris perfume? Yes, this kind of perfume is elegant in smell, and the fragrance lasts long. Okay, could you get me the 1.7 ounce bottle? That will be my pleasure. I'll wrap the perfume up in a gift box for you, too. Thank you for your consideration. Dialogue 2 I'm looking for some blusher. Do you have some in peach rose? Oh, yes, I have two left. Here you are. This is a beautiful color. It has been very popular blush this season. Great, I'll take this one. Do you need anything else? No, thank you. Women's Clothes Dialogue 1 Can I help you, ma'am? Yes, I want to buy a dress. What about this kind of dress in Chanel? It's one of our biggest sellers. It looks nice. Do you have this in size 6? Sorry, it's one size that fits all, but I think it fits you. Let me see. Do you think a cream one will fit me? Well, the cream one is beautiful indeed, but I think the black one will suit you better. Really? Please get it for me. Follow me. I'll take you to the fitting room. If you need any help, let me know. I'll be sure to. Dialogue 2 Do you have any gowns for about $50? Yes, we do have some new arrivals that may interest you. I'm looking for something special. Would you like this design in red? It's on sale now. The gown feels very well. How much is it? $45. Is this made of pure silk? Yes, it is. It's velvety and brilliant. Is it washable? Yes, it is. But you have to be careful. But I don't like the color. How about the lavender one? Good. May I try it on? Certainly. Men's Clothes Dialogue 1 Good morning. I'm looking for a tie. Our ties are over here next to coats and jackets. May I see these ties? Yes, certainly. Here's a nice looking one, a special color of Hawaii. Yes, it is attractive, but I think it's a little too loud. Let me see that gray and blue one. This one? Yes, that's the one. It's very nice. I'll take it. Okay. Do you need packing? No, it's just for myself. Dialogue 2 Can I help you? I want a leather jacket. What color did you have in mind? Khaki green. What size, please? Size 40. Let's see. Yes, here's a size 40. Would you like to try it on? Yes, please. This is a little too big. Do you have something smaller? Sure. Try this size 39. Yes, this fits very well. I'll take it. It'll be 15% off the price. You've got a good deal. That is good. Thank you. Shoes Dialogue 1 Can I help you? I'm looking for a pair of black shoes. What size do you want? Size 9. I'm afraid we haven't got any black shoes in that size at the moment, but we have got brown ones. Hmm, that is fine too. What about that pair over there? Reasonable. Can I try them on? Certainly. Here is the shoe lifter. Thank you. Hmm. They seem a little bit tight. Here is a larger size. Dialogue 2 What can I do for you, sir? 
I like some leather shoes. Okay, what's your size? I don't know American sizes. No problem. Put your foot here. Let me see. Yes, you're a six. Just a moment, please. Here you are. These are very comfortable. Try these on. Yes, they're very nice. But I want slip-ons. How about these? They don't have laces. Try them. Fine, I'll take these. Duty-free goods. Dialogue 1. How do we go about purchasing things in this catalog? You can order them here on the plane or visit one of the duty-free shops in the airport when we land. How much is this Remy Martin VSOP? It's $45. It's our special offer today. Okay, I'd like five bottles. Sorry, there's a limit on some of the items. You are limited to purchase only three bottles of wine or liquor. Well, let me have three. Dialogue 2 Good afternoon. Can I help you? I'd like to get something duty-free here. Okay, sir. Would you please show me your passport and your air ticket? Sure, here you are. Do you know how much liquor I'm allowed to take away from America? Up to two bottles per person. Okay, I will take these two. You will receive our check for duty exemption in about two months. Can I take those items now? Sorry, you can't. We will send them to the airport. Reserving a table. Dialogue 1. Good morning. The Good Boy Restaurant. Can I help you? Yes, I'd like to reserve a table for dinner. What time would you like your table, sir? I'm not sure. About 5 o'clock p.m. Okay. How many in your party? A party of four. Then I'll reserve a table for four at 5 p.m., sir. May I have your name, please? Yes. Wang Hong. Thanks. Goodbye. Dialogue 2 I'd like to make a reservation for tonight. For how many people, please? Five adults and two children. For what time, please? About 7.30 this evening. How much do you want to spend? About $20 per person. We'd like to sit together. Okay, and may I have your name? Yes, Jordan. And put us as close as possible to the window, please. I would not be sure, but I'll try my best. Taking a seat. Dialogue 1 Good evening, sir. Welcome to our restaurant. Have you made a reservation? Yes, I have booked a table for four. Here is the reservation list. My name is Dung. We have chosen a window table for you. This way, please. Will this table be all right, sir? Certainly. It's quite good. Thank you. You are welcome, sir. This separate room has a very good view of the city. This room is near the band platform. Is it going to be very noisy when the band plays some music? Oh, don't worry, sir. The sound of the music is quite soft. We'll not bring you any inconvenience. Could you stay and listen to it for a while? If you don't like it, I'll find another table for you. Is that okay? That's great. You really give good service indeed. Dialogue 2 my name is Lisa. I made a reservation of table for three. Yes, madam. Would you like a table in the smoking or non-smoking section? In the non-smoking section, please. Come this way, please. Here we are. Oh, it's a nice private room with a beautiful view. Thank you very much. Have a good time. Ordering food. Dialogue 1. Here's your menu. Could you tell us about the specials of the day? We have coconut shrimp, served with rice and a side salad. We also have prime rib, only $8 per person, including salad, choice of potato or rice, and a roll. 
I think I'll just have your prime rib with rice. Would you like appetizers or a salad to go with that? Yes, I'll take salad. Dialogue 2 Would you like an appetizer to start with? I'd like to try the egg salad. That's good. And then? I'm going to try the oysters florentine. Well, what about the entree? What is this one? Dover sole chablisine. That sole with mushroom and snail butter. That sounds nice. I'll have that. Okay. Hurrying the waiter to serve up. Dialogue 1. Here is the sole salad. Is it yours? Yes, it's ours. And we have ordered another dish. Italian-style fried bacon rolls. It's coming. We have an appointment at noon. Will you tell the cooks to hurry up? Certainly. Thank you very much. Dialogue 2 Excuse me. Yes? Our food seems to be taking a long time, doesn't it? We ordered half an hour ago, but our meal hasn't arrived yet. We have to leave pretty soon. I'm sorry. I'll see what's happened. Thank you. Service during the meal. Dialogue 1. Do you enjoy the dish? Yes, it's really good. Would you like more? Oh, yes. Just more share. Yes, I will get you right away. By the way, please give me a glass of water. Okay, I'll bring it right away. Anything else? Can I have a doggy bag? I want to take the beef home. Sure, I will wrap it up for you. Dialogue 2 It doesn't taste right to me. It's too weak. Could you get me some salt? Sure. Will that be all? And we want to share this food. Could you bring some small plates? Just a minute. Here are your salt and two small plates. Thank you very much. Always at your service. Please enjoy your meal. Having fast food. Dialogue 1. That looks good. I'll have a hamburger. The works? No, just lettuce and tomatoes. Anything to drink? A large Coke. That'll be $1.60. Here's your number. Should I wait at the counter or find a table to sit down? Just wait here. It will be ready in three minutes. Dialogue 2 Hey guys, what'll it be? I'd like a double cheeseburger, fries, and a shake. And I'll have a filet of fish, a chicken burger, larger tossed salad, onion rings, and a shake. What flavors would you like for your shakes? Strawberry. Tropical fruit. Altogether, that'll be $6.98. Here's a 10. Is that for here or to go? For here. Here's your change, $3.02. Thanks, folks. Enjoy. Drinking in the bar. Dialogue 1. I'll have a bottle of the stronger one, please. Certainly, sir. Here you are. And a large scotch, please. On the rock, sir? No, thanks. Anything else, sir? Yes, something non-alcoholic for me, please. A tonic water, fruit juice, or a ginger ale, perhaps? Tomato juice, please. Dialogue 2 A pint of bitter, please, bartender. I'm sorry, sir, but we only have two types of beer, the medium-strength beer and the export beer. Which is better? Well, the export beer is stronger, but both are the light-larger type. They are bottled. I'm afraid we do not have draft beer. I'll have a bottle of the stronger on, please. Certainly, sir. Here you are. Paying the bill. Dialogue 1. Are you all through, sir? Yes. Did you enjoy your dinner? 
Yes, everything was very good. Can I have my bill, please? Yes, one moment, please. Here you are, sir. Here is seventy dollars. Keep the change, please. Thank you. Please come again. We will. Bye. Dialogue two. Did you enjoy your dinner, Mama? Oh, very much. Just excellent. I'd like to pay my bill. Yes, Mama. Your bill comes to two hundred eighty-two francs. Do you mind if I pay it with a credit card? I'm sorry, Mama. We do not honor credit cards here. Oh, I see. Then I'll pay in cash. And what's the exchange rate today? It's nine point five francs to a dollar. Here is thirty dollars. Keep the change. Thank you. Your receipt is here. Please come again. Thank you. Consulting sightseeing information. Dialogue one. Are there any bus tours in the city? Certainly, we have a one-day tour and a half-day tour. Can I have a copy of the route map and schedule? Sure, here you are. I'd like to take a one-day tour. Does it include the admission to the park and museum? Yes, it includes all expenses. Only meals will be at your own cost. Do you think I can visit all those places in one day? No, you can't. If you want to take a good look. Dialogue two. What kind of tours do you have? What kind of tour would you like? Is there a sightseeing bus tour? Yes, we have many kinds. Where can I book a sightseeing tour? Just step to the next window. Do you have tours every day? All days except for Sundays. Do you have a half day tour? No, all the tours we have take all day. Buying tickets. Dialogue one. How much is a ticket? Twenty dollars for adults and ten dollars for children. What about for students? It is ten dollars too. Two tickets for students, please. Please show me your certificates first. Well, we just forgot to take them with us. I'm afraid you can't buy half-price tickets without showing certificates. Can't we? No, you must buy the tickets for adults. Dialogue two. How much is the ticket? It's ten dollars for adults and six dollars for children under twelve years old. Two for adults and three for children. By the way, how much does it cost to ride roller coaster? Five dollars. Then five tickets for roller coaster. You have to buy them inside. Oh, all right. Here are your tickets. Thank you. Taking pictures. Dialogue one. Excuse me, madam. Would you mind taking a few pictures for us? Sure. Just stand over there. Can you get the whole square in? Move back a little bit. Now to the left. There, that's perfect. Say cheese. Good. Thanks. Could you take one more shot, please? I can't get it focused. Just push the button on the front, under the lens. It should zoom in. Got it. Could you snap a picture for us next to this sign? You've got it. Move in a little closer, there, friends. Don't squint. Thanks for everything. Dialogue two. Look, the sun is rising. What a beautiful sight! I have never seen such a beautiful sight. Take pictures, please. Well, please just stand there. I will take a picture for you. Can you take the sun into the picture? Of course, it is just besides you. Are you ready? Ready. One, two, three. Okay. Thank you. Taking the tour bus. Dialogue one. Welcome to take the tour bus. 
Does the morning tour visit the UN? No, sir. That's in the all day tour. Then I have to get off to take the all day tour. But during this tour, we will visit the most famous place. You shouldn't miss it. Where will you go? The famous Broadway. I promise you will think it worth going. Okay, then I will go on this trip with you. How long does the tour last? It takes six hours, sir. I see. Can I pay in traveler's checks? Of course you can. That's $25. Dialogue 2 Welcome to this sightseeing tour. First, we will go to the Chinatown, then the National Museum, and the City Hall. Hooray! We're now passing Columbia University. I see it! Good university! Excuse me, what is that tall building? It's the United Nations building. Wow, the United Nations? Can we make a stop here? Sorry, but it's beyond our schedule. It's really a pity. I have to take another time to see it. Watching the game. Dialogue 1. Do you still have tickets for today? We have plenty left. Can I get a ticket for a Major League Baseball game? Any team in particular. Are the Mariners playing today? Let me see if I can find out. Ah, yes, one? Yes, only one, please. The game will be very exciting, as this is an important match. Hope the Mariners will have good performance. Dialogue 2 Where is the stadium? There's a pretty good stadium in town. I would love to see a ball game. Which teams are playing? I heard that Bulls vs. Lakers this week. Is that true? Do you think we can get tickets? We can go to the box office to check it out. If not, we can always try our fortune at the door. It seems you are really a die-hard fan of basketball. You blow me away. Making Friends Dialogue 1 This is a lovely place. So it is. Where are we now? What is this station? This is Iran. How long will we stop here? Only a few minutes. How soon will we go to Madrid? Not for four more hours. That's a long time. I'm hungry. So am I. How about going to the buffet car? Good idea. We can have a drink. Dialogue 2 Hi, how do you do? I'm Jack. Hi, how do you do? I'm Li Jian. Are you on business or pleasure? I'm going on business. Where to? Newfoundland. My goodness, that's where I go too. Really? What a coincidence. Maybe we can go around between the connecting flights. Good idea. The plane is landing. Let's go together. Okay. Losing the Way Dialogue 1 Good morning, sir. I think I'm lost here. I want to go to a hotel called Jinmun. Do you know on which street? No, I'm sorry I have no idea. You know I'm a stranger here. I see. Well, do you know any landmarks near the hotel? Oh, yes. My friend told me the hotel was just around Pizza Hut. Then you'll have to take bus number 37 and get off at Li Shi Road. Dialogue 2 Excuse me, but will you tell me the way to the art museum? Go straight on the street. Go three blocks and you'll come to a park. The museum is in the park. How long does it take on foot? About 20 minutes. Thank you very much. Oh, once more. Could you show me the way to the post office? Go two blocks, and on the corner on the right, you'll find the Westbury Hotel. The post office is on the first floor. You can easily find the office as you can see the post office sign.
Getting ill on the way. Dialogue 1 What's wrong with you? I have an upset stomach. Do you want to see a doctor? I have been suffering from this old disease for quite a long time. There is no point to seeing a doctor. But I think you need to see a doctor as we are going on the journey. If something goes wrong, we have to carry the can. Well, let's go and see a doctor then. Wait a moment. I will call the bus driver and he will drive you to the hospital. Thanks a lot. You're very considerate. Dialogue 2 Good morning, sir. But you look pale. I didn't sleep well last night. I feel completely exhausted now. Oh, I'm sorry. You'd better see a doctor. Could you tell me where the nearest hospital is? It'll take you half an hour to go to the number one hospital by bus number 108. If you take a taxi, it takes only five minutes. Please call a taxi for me. Sure. Lost Property Dialogue 1 I can't find my passport. Do you remember when did you see it for the last time? Yes, I just saw it in my bag yesterday afternoon. Oh, then how have it gone? I don't know either. It is lost now. Could you help me find it? Sure. We must unfold all of our baggage and search for it. Thank you. I hope we could find it. Otherwise, we have to make touch with the Chinese embassy. Dialogue 2 Excuse me. Yes, may I help you? I lost my wallet. I had my credit card and passport in it. What's your name? Wang Ming. What kind of wallet is it? It's black, about this size, with the initial WM on the inside. Let me check. Is it this one? Fantastic. It's mine. Thank you so much. You're welcome. This wallet was found on the street by a schoolboy. Dialing Public Calls Dialogue 1 May I use this telephone for an international call? Yes, but do you have the telephone card? No, I'm just a traveler here. Then you have to exchange some coins. Could you change the dollar bill for coins? Yes, give me the money and I will change for you. Okay, here you are. And here are the coins. Go ahead, please. Just insert the coin into the slot here. Deposit 75 cents for the first three minutes, please. Oh, thank you very much. Dialogue 2 May I use this telephone? Of course, please. Could you tell me the way of using the telephone? Yes, you should insert a coin first. How much should I put in it? At least 20 cents. And then I can dial the number directly, can I? Yes, it will give you the conduction sign. Looking for the washroom. Dialogue 1 That curry is playing hell with my insides. Nothing is the matter with me. Is there a comfort station nearby? Yes, on the left side at the end of this way. Is there an entrance fee? No, it's free of charge. Excuse me for a moment. I'll be right back. Dialogue 2 Where is the women's restroom? Do you see where that woman just turned around? Are you talking about the one in the blue shirt? Yes, that one. Go there and turn right. Thanks. My husband also needs to go. Is the men's restroom there too? Yes. New York Dialogue 1 This is Central Park, isn't it? Yes, we can enter by the main gate. Okay. Wow, it looks very large. Right. It covers an enormous area. Do you come here often? I like to come whenever I have time. It's very nice weather, so it's pleasant to take a walk. 
Not too many people today. No, but on Sundays and holidays, it's quite crowded. Dialogue two. Well, what do you think of this city? Is it bigger than you thought? Yes, I'm quite impressed. The subway system is pretty well developed now. It looks wonderful. Do the roads go all across the city? Yes, it's a big network. So you can drive anywhere very quickly. Yes, it's very convenient. Hawaii. Dialogue one. Welcome to Molokini Snorkel Cruise. Oh, wonderful! Come aboard our fifty-five foot power catamaran, the Frogman, and let us bring you three miles off the shores of Maui to an ancient volcanic cinder cone called Molokini. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready? Ready. Molokini is a world-class dive area and a marine life conservation district seabird sanctuary, known for its colorful sea life and clear water. How about the visibility? It often exceeds one hundred feet. Great! Look, so many fishes. They are tropical fishes. With good luck, you'll be able to see monk seals, whale sharks, manta rays, and white tip reef sharks. Anyone want an ice cold beverage? No, thanks. Don't forget, they are provided free of charge all day, ready to serve you any time. Ha ha! Thanks. Dialogue two. I want to make a fun trip on this island. Could you give me some advice? Sure, I'm planning to take part in a funny tour. What is it? It is Starlit Tropical Ocean Fun Cruise. Driving on the sea? Yes, it includes Starlit snorkeling lesson and guided snorkel tour of the Rainbow Reef, fishing, water slide, water trampoline, kayaking, and other fun water toys. How did you know? On internet. Why don't you browse on net and get more about it? I would rather not do that. In fact, I have almost decided to go with you. Yeah. So that would be a wonderful tour, open sun deck, relaxing expert narration, and marine life identification by the captain and crew. Freshly grilled barbecue lunch buffet, open soda bar. London. Dialogue one. I'd like to visit the famous spots in London. Can you tell me what they are? Well, the British Museum, Buckingham Palace, the House of Parliament, Big Ben, Oxford Street are all good points of interest in this city. Especially the palace, you should never miss because it's quite unique. Oh, I can't wait to go, but I have only one day. So, do you think I can visit all of those places in one day? No, you can't unless you want to take a quick glance. That's too bad, but I still can choose a few of them. Then what's the best way to do my sightseeing? In that case, I suggest you call a cab. It will save you a lot of time. Dialogue two. This is Westminster Abbey. It's one of the oldest buildings in London. You will recognize different styles from its architecture. Busts and monuments remind us of William Shakespeare, Walter Scott, and many others like that. To the left, you can see the House of Parliament, with the famous clock tower, Big Ben. In this building, there are the House of Commons and the House of Lords. There, to the left, you can see a small street called Downing Street. Number ten, the last house, has always been the residence of the British Prime Minister. Now we're approaching Trafalgar Square. This is Tower Bridge, the most striking of all London bridges. Look, the bridge parts in the middle, and two halves move upwards. Down river stretch the London docks. Athens. Dialogue one. What are you going to do for Greece? For fun. How about you? I'm going back home. So you live in Athens? Yes, my home is there. 
It's wonderful. Athens is one of the world-known oldest cities, which worshipped by gods and people. A magical city. Right. It is the city where democracy was born, and most wise men of ancient times used to live there. It's a city with the most glorious history in the world, a birthplace for civilization. You know much about Athens. Athens is one of my best favorite cities, so I read some books about it. The sun is shining over Athens all year round. The climate is one of the best in Europe, with mild winters and very hot summers, ideal for tourism. You come at the best time of it. Dialogue two. My wife and I visited Greece ten years ago. So this is your second time to Athens. How are your feelings about your returned tour? As good as before, but more familiar about it. Of all the places in Greece, what place do you favor? Sacred Rock. We love the Acropolis best. Why? As a magical city, Athens has many sights worth seeing. Right, completely. But the Acropolis is our favorite place. The site is inspiring. Ever since I visited it a few years ago, I have been thinking to come back again. So you realize what you are looking for? Yes. By the way, the view of the Acropolis at night is something you will never forget. This is also one of the most beautiful spots in Athens. Thank you. I will get a good look about it. Venice. Dialogue one. We come at the right time. The end of February and beginning of March is a travel off season, but here is a different scene. Yes, look, Venetians are celebrating in the streets. The beautiful music is comforting the enjoying persons. Hurry up! The carnival is coming. Take it easy, honey. Have you made up? Make up? Is it necessary? Certainly. During the traditional Venetian carnival, people will dress up in historical costumes and wear intriguing black masks and aristocratic capes. We should incorporate with the local atmosphere. Okay. Why not make some color on face and change a strange hairstyle? Done. Dialogue two. Like every tourist location. Tourists in Venice must get cameras ready any time. That's true. Could you help me to take a photo here? I like the bridge. In fact, that is one of the attractions in Venice. It indeed has many remarkable structures, such as an impressive array of bronzework, tapestries, and paintings from the fifth to sixth century. Yes, I have noticed a number of them. Very spectacular. It's time for lunch now. Let's find a place to have dinner. Good. Do you have some suggestion? You cannot go wrong with the area surrounding Campo di Santa Margherita in San Polo, if you are looking for the upbeat bars and tasty Venice restaurants. Paris. Dialogue one. To see the best, you had better visit the tower gradually. How? You can visit in three stages. First, you can take the elevator to the first landing. There, you have a view over the rooftops of Paris, and then you come to the second landing. It provides a panoramic look at the city. The third and final stage gives the most spectacular view. You'd better not go to the top landing directly. I see. What can I see within the tower? There are so many for you to visit. For example. On the third level, you can visit Eiffel's office. In the office, you can see wax figures depicting the engineer receiving Thomas Edison. That's fabulous. Tomorrow morning, I'll get up early and visit it first. Dialogue two. Ready to go out? Yeah. Can you give me some help? You know, I'm going to stay here for three days, and I would like to see the Louvre, the Arc of Triumph. And the Versailles. How should I schedule my time? I think you may go to the Versailles first because it is in the suburbs of Paris. The other places are not far from the center of the city. 
I would like to go to see the Eiffel Tower at night. I hear it's very beautiful when the light's on. If you want to get to the top, you have to take the lift. And only from June 14th to August 30th, people can use the stairs till midnight. Now it closes at 6.30. That's good. I'll take the lift. Sydney Dialogue 1 Have you ever been to Sydney before? No, this is the first trip. Could you tell me what to see here? With pleasure. The attractions here are too many. How long will you stay here? A week. So, you can only visit some top attractions, such as the Sydney Opera House, Harbour Bridge. Yes, I've seen them on TV. You'd better arrange a trip to the native Aussie wildlife in the Taronga Zoo and the Sydney Aquarium. Sorry, I can't catch all these names. Can you write down these names for me? With pleasure. Have you got a map of Sydney? No, I really need one. It's available at the newspaper stand over there. Thank you very much. You've been most helpful. Dialogue 2 Wow, what a splendid design it is. Sydney Opera House is one of the biggest buildings on the earth. It has been a cultural symbol of Sydney. Can we enter the house? Certainly. Come on. Let's enjoy the spirit and art atmosphere of the Sydney Opera House. Vienna Dialogue 1 Excuse me. I'm a tourist from China. I want to enrich my musical knowledge during the trip to Vienna. Can you give me some suggestions? My pleasure. Vienna is a city of music. You might hear Mozart, Schubert, Beethoven, Strauss, or Haydn at an opera house, a church, or an open-air performance. I'm a fan of Mozart. You've landed in the right city. You'll not only be able to hear his music in the concert halls, but also visit the places in which he lived and worked. Mozart Memorial is near here, right? Yes, it's not very far from here. You just walk along the street, turn right at the corner, then walk two blocks and you will not miss it. Dialogue 2 Darling, tickets for the state opera aren't available until Friday. It's a pity. We will have left on Friday. How about the Volksoper? I heard that it also features operettas, musicals, and ballets. Okay, let me try. Oh, shit. Tickets have been fully reserved in advance. I know the City Hall hosts free concerts in summer. Why not go there to have a try? Okay, but before the concert, we still have time. We can go up to the top of the Danube Tower to see a panorama. Great, good idea. That will be a more elevated impression of the city. Cairo Dialogue 1 Why did ancient Egyptians call Cairo mother of the cities? Because it is the largest city in Egypt and also in the Arabdom. And why is Cairo named City of Towers? Because there are many minarets. What should I see in Cairo? Well, the museum, Sultan Hassan Mosque, and Madrasa, Citadel of Saladin, the Tower of Cairo, and the world-known pyramids. It's said that the Pyramids of Giza is really something. Yes, you better take a look at that. Dialogue 2 Look, that's the Great Pyramid. Oh, yes, it looks very high. It's about 137 meters high. How long are the sides? They are 230 meters. It's incredible! How old is it? It's nearly 4,500 years old.